guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well happy new year 2023 it's been such a long time since i picked up the camera and you know filmed something but i'm really excited because this is my first video of 2023 and the first of many, hopefully. So for today's video, I'm very excited to be showing you a wonderful new product today that I was generously gifted by this wonderful brand. And that is the Timo Rotating Curling Iron. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I achieved these wonderful curls waves that are just, you know, super shiny and loose and bouncy, then keep on watching. All right, so I actually have the immense pleasure of working with um, this incredible brand that gifted me this great curling iron that I will be using today. It's the brand Timo and it's the rotating curling iron. Now, if you have difficulty using any curling iron, this will be your savior because it's so easy to use. Um, I will show you guys how to use it. All you have to do is basically clip your hair and then rotate and it's done. It does the work for you. So it's just incredible. Um, so when you open the box, this is what you get. Ooh. I dropped, I dropped the instruction manual. So you obviously have a little instruction manual that you can read, get to know the product um, whatsoever. And then right here you have all of like the settings. You have a nice little travel bag that you can use, which I really love this because it's so convenient whenever you're traveling. You have a little glove. And then they also include two clips in case you want to, you know, pin your hair up, whatever, put it out of your face. So it's just like really great to have. And then you have the curling iron, which in my opinion is super stunning. You have this nice matte black handle. So this is your power button right here, a reset button for your rotating directions. So let's plug her up. Not gonna lie, I actually already used it once and I was obsessed with the results. So I'm very, very excited to show you all what it looks like. All right, so to turn it on, all you have to do is press um, on the button for like maybe two seconds. And then I like to, to leave it on the third setting, but if you want your curling tool to be hotter, then you can just press again and it'll, you know, upgrade the temperature to a higher temperature. I think it's best to leave it on the third setting just because you don't want to damage your hair too much and it's better to not apply too much heat. So that setting to me is perfect. And while I wait for it to, you know, warm up, I'm actually gonna apply my primer, this one, is the Gizu uh, Prep Me, Prime Me, Define Me. I actually always use this product. I really, really love it. It really gives you that long lasting effect. So I apply it all over the hair. You can either do it while your hair is wet or dry. I personally like to do it when it's both. So I'll apply it like right out of the shower and also right before I'm ready to style. And this also protects your hair against heat. So it's a great like two in one. Then I'm just gonna brush it out and I always like to section off my hair in two so I literally just do a half up and half down and then we bring forward the two pieces here I like to always brush it out again and now the fun part. This is actually a 1.25 inch barrel, which is great because it creates like waves that are not like too loose. Having this size allows you to have, you know, um, curls, but also waves at the same time. So they're not like tight curls. They kind of like loosen down and become like super beautiful waves. So that's just beautiful. I love that. And also the fact that it's a titanium barrel actually reduces breakage by 50%. So that's also a huge plus that we love. So I already blow dried a little bit my hair yesterday and now I'm going to take a, I would say like a one inch piece. So just as so like this. And then taking the barrel right here, I'm going to secure the end just like that. And then you just wanna press on 
the rotating button. And then you just hold. It's as simple as that. It's just great. So you just hold it until you hear the little beep. There you go. And then you're ready to release. I like to keep it a little bit longer just because my hair is a little bit thicker. So I always feel like it needs more time. But then after like maybe 10 seconds, you just want to release it. And this is what you get. Just like a very nice loose curl wave and then i always love to take it up in my hand and kind of like scrunch it to make the curl more defined like that and then place it in the back and then we repeat but i'm telling you this tool is literally so easy to use so you just lace it in the end press on the rotating button and you just watch it rotate that's it it's so easy. And then in the back and we keep going. Alright, so only two little pieces left for this little section right here. Keep in mind that generally curling my hair for each section takes about like I would say maybe five minutes um, and this right here is literally taking me maybe three minutes. So it's taking me twice less time to curl my hair, which is amazing. Can't complain if you're in a rush in the morning and you have, you know, kids to take care of or whatever, you have to get to work. It's just super, super convenient to be able to save time and have something super easy to do. the last piece on this side so now on to the next side and basically this is the same process the only thing that you're gonna do is press on the other button instead of the one that you were pressing on before so I always curl my hair away from my face if you like more of like a you know Hollywood 90s blowout look kind of situation you can always curl it inward and it'll give you more like you know volume and definition but if you want like those classic curls then just always curl um, away from your face so now again same principle I am taking the little clip and I am placing it at the bottom completely and then pressing on the other button this time And same process, just another section. So we keep going. last piece for this section right here and then we do the top I just I can't get over how easy this is it's just you can just watch a TV show at the same time and all you have to do is press on a button and it curls your hair for you it's just absolutely insane great it's great but it's just it's crazy and we're done so this is what it looks like so far I don't want to touch the curls yet. I obviously want to let them cool down and then we're going to play with them with some finishing products. So for now, you just want to let them set and cool and then we're going to play with them later. So I'm going to take off this top section right here and start working on the top part. So I'm sectioning it in two again, brushing through the hair and we're going to do the same thing. So we're 
almost done. I'm finishing up this section right here. And then I'm gonna go style my bangs with the Dyson Airwrap, just cause I love using the round brush um, and a roller to style those. But you can definitely use this curling tool as well, just you know, to curl your bangs away from the face, or even like pin them with a roller afterward, and it'll give you like a nice voluminous effect. It's just so satisfying watching it roll away and then you know give you this beautiful curl. It's just very satisfying and so easy. I'm sorry, I know I said that a lot, but. I still can't get over it. And I do love that since it's on a low setting, it doesn't feel like it's burning my hair at all. I mean, my hair feels really, really soft and shiny. So I do really love that as well. Um, generally with other tools, what happens is they're super, super hot. So they tend to burn the hair and I hate when it leaves that like, you know, smell of burnt hair and this doesn't do that at all. So it's a great advantage that it has over other curling tools um, that you might have. I have a lot of layers in the front part of my face, so it's a little bit more difficult to section it off, but we manage. We manage pretty fine. All right, we are done curling the hair. Ooh, there's like a little piece here that's like, not cooperating uh you know what i'm just gonna do it like that because you can also use it like this different ways to use it like i said so i'm gonna go style my bangs and i'll be back and we're gonna you know zhuzh it up a little bit play with it i have some product so it's gonna look overall fantastic i'm very excited to show you guys the final results okay we're back we're done curling the hair. I secured my bangs in a nice little roller and now I'm gonna take it down and we're gonna style everything and you know, give you the final result for all of this. So approximately it took me like about 15 minutes to curl all of my hair. I would say it's a very reasonable time. I'm just gonna, you know, take apart the little roller like that. Put it in the back and like this. I love, love this. So then the first thing that I do is always go ahead with a dry shampoo um, or a texture spray, whatever I have. I'm out of my texture spray right now, so I'm gonna use the dry shampoo. Um, I'm using the Brio Geo, this one right here, if it wants to focus, yeah. The Scalp Revival charcoal and biotin dry shampoo. I love this stuff. I've been using it for years. It's a powder dry shampoo, so it really like absorbs any excess oil right away, but it also just gives you like more of a natural finish and less like clumpy, I find. It's like, it's not crusty. It's not like, it doesn't look like you have anything in your hair. So I'm just going to squeeze a little bit and put everywhere in my hair and then just massage it in. And I find that this automatically gives so much volume. And then I take my little comb and then just brushing the hair up. Like that. And then I'm gonna go with a little hair oil and putting this everywhere on my ends. And there you have it. This is the final look. I am obsessed, like truly, truly, truly obsessed. Um, it's like those soft curls, bouncy, super, super shiny. I know that these last, they la last time I did them, they lasted me like for about two to three days, even though they are kind of like looser, I find that they do last longer. So that's also a huge plus. And I just, look how shiny my hair is. It's just, I think it's just, it's great. It's a great product, 
great for beginners great for someone who doesn't really know how to curl their hair and needs a little bit help basically this product does the job for you so it's kind of great but yeah if you guys are interested i will leave the link down below for this amazing tool i am super super happy and honored that they decided to work with me and i cannot wait to hear you guys' you know comments and what you think of it so hopefully you enjoyed the video let me know if you have any questions and if not then have a beautiful day and i will talk to you guys soon bye